64-year-old Sandy Mustard beat cervical cancer in 2005, but she wasn't prepared for the chronic health problems that started years later, suddenly after a hike. My left leg was very swollen from the ankle up to about my knee. That was the start of years of lymphedema, painful swelling like this, and dangerous skin infections. And they told me there's no cure for lymphedema. Cancer researcher Electra Paskett knows firsthand. Paskett is a three-time cancer survivor. My youngest was two years old when it was found on just a routine mammogram. Paskett developed lymphedema in her arm. Now she focuses her research on survivors of other cancers. Lymphedema of the lower extremities is extremely understudied. Paskett found that more than 30 percent of ovarian, endometrial, and colorectal cancer survivors develop leg lymphedema. The researchers found these survivors have reduced function. Many can't walk, stand, or drive a car. If they're not able to get up and move around, then that severely impacts their health. Sandra Mustard wears a compression stocking to control the swelling and had specialized surgeries to reduce the size of her leg. After years of struggling with the condition, she can kneel down and work in her flower garden. Now I can continue to do that, stand on my legs for long periods of time. I'm Marty Salt reporting.